All right. Here we are. Here We're we back. Are. <laughs> We're back on a different channel. So if you are jumping over from the Carry the Mortician channel, thank you. We are here at Mount Olivet Cemetery. Yep. Here in Kalamazoo, Michigan. Getting ready to walk into the old section. Um, the oldest. So I used to see some of this section from another road. There's a big angel. So we're on a hunt to go find this big angel somewhere out here in this section of the cemetery. Kind of the original, it looks like, some of the original cemetery. I always think when there's little bowls in cemeteries, they're a little mildly creepy to me, and I'm not sure why. I don't know why either. <laughs> and what I mean by bowl is... Oh, this sits way down. Yeah. If you can't is... tell, we are going to go... Oh, it's down. Way down from the rest of the cemetery. Down. Down <clears throat> a hill here. No. Down into this gully. And but I think the angel that you're seeing too is up in that is up in the other section. Okay. So we'll walk up here. There used to be Hold a on, foot. I'm gonna turn this so we can watch Josh okay. walk. Well, there used to be a footpath. We'll see if it's still there. If not, we'll jump in the truck and we'll drive back around. So look at the, you guys talk about stone orientation a lot. <laughs> look at this. Every which way. So they are all facing the center of this little section here. Yep. The hospital helicopter. Yep, medevac. Medevac is coming over. But this is kind of crazy how these are facing here, but then those are facing the middle, and the ones where Josh is standing are facing towards the middle as well. And then it goes back up the hill for more burial back in there. I'm going to walk and look at this cute little baby grave that is definitely, I mean, this is maintained. Someone is coming here yep. from this baby that died in 1917. 1917. Yeah. Is still coming here. And that's a newer headstone. Yeah, it and is. And marked this grave and cares for this grave. Yep. That's which pretty is cool. pretty awesome. It that is pretty awesome. does that. I'm going to just walk up here quick and then we'll run back over the other way. So they've definitely had some trees and stuff come down in here. You got, this maybe is a little bit, um, some baby section here actually, because if you look, a lot of these are, I think this is like the original baby section. I think you're right. Because these are all yeah. babies, all babies right, right here. Well, and up here, they're all like one or two year. Yeah. Or a couple day old, or only one day. Day old, yeah, 1936. So these are all babies down in here. Yep. In the sections. Um, all of these are. Yep. See, and I guess I never realized that because I've buried some people up over in here. And this person is about 25. Yep. So a little. But kind of a cool, it's stone. No, sandstone. It's sandstone, it's not granite, and it's got yeah. this crucifix. You see that big old stone knocked over? I don't know if I'd say the tree fell on it. Oh. It's a lot of times in these, a lot of times in these old cemeteries and these old sections, you get a lot of vandalism from time to time where idiots will come in and shove stones over. It's a nice word for it. Well, they are. I mean, it's just a light word. Right. So, for what they do. I mean, this was put up so people couldn't drive back here, obviously. Um, all these sections have these, like, markers. Old style markers that tell us kind of the layouts of everything. But we're going to go try and find this angel. Yep, I'm guessing. That I would see driving into work. Like I told you guys, I put on my, my boots. Because I don't know what we're getting into, but we'll follow him. Well, again, there used to be a footpath that went around and went up here. And if you're seeing it from Riverview, it had to be this section over here. Well, we'll go on an adventure. Yes, we are. So why don't you tell us the story while we're going. Have you had any creepy things happen when you're out at cemeteries by yourself waiting for? <laughs> yeah, I was at a cemetery one time. And it was pouring down rain and I was trying to hurry up and get my setup done. And I had my rain gear on, so I had my hood pulled around my head and tied tight. And I'm working and I'm working and I get that creepy feeling like somebody's looking at me. And I was in a smaller town 
and I was probably 100 yards off the road. And as I get that feeling, all of a sudden I look up, and as I look up, there's a guy standing on the edge of the road. It was like from a horror movie. He had a hood over him, a rain poncho, and he was just standing there like this, just staring at me. And I just kind of startled me, and I ended up saying something to him, and he never spoke to me. He just kind of stared at me again for a minute, and then he just walked away, and I never saw him again. But weird things like that. I've been working in the cemetery and heard something and turned around, and there'd be a dog walking up behind me. So this looks like, just to show you guys, like we're up in a footpath. This looks like the back little corner of this whole section. Yep. So this, hold on, I'm going to peek around this tree. This one stone right here is like the furthermost stone yep, back yep. in this section, which well, is kind of And if you look crazy. down here, or is there more? see the old stone? That's, That's the like, old stone marker for like the, the side, edge of the post. cemetery. Yeah. Yeah. And then it drops down into like a swampy area and then the police station's on the other side of that. So. So it's got it. Well, yeah, because it's right before the police station on the road. Yep. Is it's, this angel. It's, it's going to be right up here. It's going to be right up here. All I want is to find the angel. And there's supposed to be a few other things that are down in that section that they say is the old Jewish section, which I still don't understand the Jewish section in the Catholic cemetery. It's going to be this section and see, we're going to run into them up here, weed whacking and doing stuff. That's fine. I can ask them where that stone is then. Yeah, but. Right? See, this is an open field. So is it going to be down in there? It's going to be up over in here, I'm guessing. They're back here power washing stuff, it looks like. Can we get up there? No, they're weed whipping. We can walk around this way. And this is tall grass, so I'm glad I wore my boots. Yep. We should have pulled back into that section, probably. Yep. yep. We should have, but we didn't. What do you do? What do you do? It's so bright out here. Yeah, it's hard I to cannot see. see what oh, we're actually okay. doing. So cool. Look at they made a little staircase for us. Or we could go down there. That takes yeah, us to the back. That could be it. I know it's got to be back here somewhere. There's a big. It's not an angel, but that looks like a Jesus. No, this thing is literally out in the woods and there's nothing else by it. So the last week or so, man, I got a lot of cross channel talking going on today. So over <laughs> on Carrie the Mortician, I have had you guys send me this news article about this kid who cleans headstones. He charges like $20 a headstone and he does veterans ones for free. That's awesome. So I go to his Facebook, doesn't say where he's located. No idea where this kid is in the hole, anywhere. So I think, oh, that's the bleeding headstone. Yep. The bleeding one. So we'll come over here quick. Um, so I message this kid. He lives five minutes from me. Ah, uh, that's five. funny. So you guys who have sent me the article, we'll be doing them doing a story okay so this is here reverend there's Jenner. a lot going on right here and there's werner that you were talking yep. about oh look at see there's i didn't realize these were even back here all right because look at all the stones over there so yeah those are the ones that i'm talking about i'm yep. so excited to be in here yeah Ooh, this is kind of this is what you're seeing down here yeah <laughs> yeah yeah yeah, I knew it. Um, so here's one Reverend from 1902. But this, Father Werner, this was the second burial here in the whole cemetery. Yep. Now, this is the one that they say had, has a bleeding, they call this the bleeding cross. Huh. Because what? of the dark stuff. Yeah, look at right there. That Down comes off there. of it. And they say more and more comes off. Yeah, that's weird. That's kind of creepy. So they call this Reverend John Joseph Kramer. The Bleeding Cross. And he was buried. At a priest. 1969. 1912 12, he died. Yep. Wow. Yeah. 
crazy. All right, so let's go find. We'll walk down over here. We're gonna go find the angel. And supposedly there was a couple. It's a turkey. Oh, <laughs> do you guys have these in your state? Turkey, wild turkey. Um, I don't think I can get over it quick enough before he waddles away. He's gonna take off. He was, laying, wild he, he was laying down there. Like, is that a thing? That's a Tom. He's got a beard. Like, that's a normal thing for us here is turkeys. Yeah. But maybe you guys don't have them because I didn't know that deer and roadkill all the, over, like dead deer on the side of the roads wasn't a, a, a thing, thing in some everywhere. <laughs> right. That's it. So. Oh my gosh. You know what? In all my in all my almost 30 years of doing this, I have never been this far back into the cemetery. I knew there was a section back here, but I've just never came so, back here. This is the it looks like original block. Yes. A. And this and that's what you're seeing from Riverview when there's no leaves on the trees. <laughs> so, I'm so excited to Yeah, that. this is cool. This is legit. I mean, it's super overrun. These are some of my favorite stones, the ones that the look ones like that tree look like stones. Trees. Yeah. Margaret Rolf. Oh when was she? she? Died 1892. So she was one of the first ones. Yeah, in 1898. Here. I'd say this was the very first section in here. Yeah, this is Black A. So this is where it all started for this cemetery. And this goes, I can't, do you guys see how steep this is? I'm holding this straight out in front I'll, of me. And Josh is down. just a few steps down from me. It's a sheer drop. So I'm looking straight ahead and you're going to see how far down he is going. Which is crazy train. Yeah, Christine, you would think this was awesome. I think I told you about this when we had coffee the one day when you won having coffee. It is so crazy. So in the fall, when the leaves have fallen and these trees are not covered and you drive down, there is a road right behind, hmm. right behind there. You guys can hear it. Hey. There's cars right there. You can see all Come of this. down here. I'm, um, and there's tons of stones up in here that are all 1889, 1903. And a lot of these stones, I'm going to wager, are ones that have been put in since to mark these graves. Because some of this type of stone was not very common back then. This style was more common. But, you know, this style granite was, was not as common. This is the one with the gunshots in it. Oh, yeah. So the big talk of there's Jesus holding Joseph or Joseph holding Jesus. And it was all shot up by gun. Oh, look, they came yeah. and shot at it for target practice. Some of those really horrible people. See, look, at, there's a bullet hole in his. So this is somebody, I mean, this is one of the first, in the first 10 years. Yep. Martin Delaney. Born Queens County, Ireland. Yeah, look at the baby's got a bullet hole in the head and he's got a bullet hole below his eye and his chest. And then there, I see three. Yep. Clear. Yep. One through the baby head, one through the eye there, the baby's head, and then huh. right there through the chest. That's crazy. Yeah, like find something better to shoot at than Joseph and Jesus people. Right. Particularly yeah. maybe targets, not people or anything naughty. Right. Let's see if there's anything else good down. See, I don't here. know where the first um what was the name of the first lady? Was it Mary Conway or something like that? I can't that? remember Is her she... last right here. Is that her? Yep, Mary Conway. Right here. Died December fourteenth, eighteen eighty eight. There's her stone. Cool. So and there's, there's... That's the a family stone. stone, and then that's her stone. And hers. She was only 23. Who's next to her? And then... Robert, son of T and J Conway. Daughter of... So this is her brother. Yep, that's her Robert brother. Robert was buried there, who died in 1889. Yep. So the, par oops, the parents lost two kids 
within a year of each other at young ages. Yes, indeed. Watching and waiting. Thank you. All the articles that I was reading about this said that it was Joseph carrying. Just look on there with some dark marks. I didn't know if this one had been shot too. No. But, you know, you have these just ones on the cusp. and Yeah, the way they, the way they used to bury them, there was not a lot of uniformity to it, really. They just kind of buried them. That one's gotten probably just fallen over from gravity over time. Yeah, I bet. Those. Just the graves kind of cave in. So this is when you don't have burial vaults. Nope. That the ground gets like this. It's all bumpy and everything, which I know, natural guys. But this is what I tell people is when you don't have a vault, the ground settles, caves in. Yep. Yeah, that's definitely what you're seeing from Riverview. Cause <gasps> yeah, because this... The road's right there, and there's the cemetery fence. Yeah. Or part of it. Right there. That's wild. Yeah, it is cool. I would have never wandered down here by myself, so... No worries. Yeah. It's been neat. This is cool. It's kind of fun to come, but look, you can't even see the top where we came from. No, it's... Like, it's steep. It's a hell of a steep hill. But I do see... I always thought there was art stretched arms or something like an angel, but it's... That's what I'm seeing. That is, was what you were saying. It's him through the. Yep. So that's pretty cool. Awesome. Cool. Thank you guys on going on an adventure. Yeah. You know, I thought of another cemetery, um, the one in Papa that has the graves way at the top. You've probably never even gone up. So I thought yeah, of. Yeah, it's Prospect Hill. Yeah, we've got about six or seven on our list of places to take you guys with us to show you some random wacky places. There's a Sasquatch sighting cemetery around here. Yeah. Some weird stuff. So we'll yeah. take you guys on some adventures here. Yep. Coming up. Awesome. So if you have ones you want us to go see, let us know. Yeah, give us suggestions. Drop those in the comments below. And thank you guys. Thanks, guys. Yeah, we'll see you soon. See ya. Bye.